Speed Maths – How to Multiply and Divide by 5 Let's start off with looking at how to multiply it by 5 using a mental method. So you're not going to need a calculator, not even going to need pen and paper. This will be totally in your head. So to do this, we first note that 5 is the same as 10 divided by 2. Now we've done this because 10 and 2 are a lot easier generally to use than the number 5. So instead of multiplying by 5, if we divide by 2 and multiply that result by 10, we'll get the same answer as if we were to multiply by 5. Now it doesn't matter which order you do these two things in, I generally divide by 2 first because I find it easier, but it doesn't matter. So let's try an example. We're going to do 36 times by 5. So. 36 divided by 2 is 18, times that by 10 we get 180. So 36 times by 5 equals 180. Let's try a trickier example now, so it also works for decimals. 21.4 times by 5, divide that by 2 is 10.7, multiply that answer by 10 you get 107 and that is our answer. Now, how about dividing by 5? Well, we're going to use the same fact. Remember, 5 is 10 divided by 2. But this time, because we're dividing by 5, we're just going to switch the operations around. So to divide by 5, we'd first divide by 10. Now, because we've divided by a bit too much there, we're going to multiply that result by 2 to give us our final answer. So, for example, 150 divided by 5 First of all, divide by 10, that gives you 15. Multiply that by 2 to give us an answer of 30. Again, this works with trickier examples. Suppose we want to do 364 divided by 5. So note how this one isn't going to divide exactly, because it ends in a 4. But we're going to use the same method. Divided by 10 is 36.4, double that answer, 72.8 and that is our answer.